What's going on guys? Coming to Justice here and today we're back with another LSPDFR tutorial. God bless you guys. God bless America. God bless our troops that are fighting for our freedom. God bless our veterans and God bless Israel. So today guys I'm going to be showing you how to install chill callouts. Now these were just updated yesterday. I know a lot of people have been uh, coming to my discord talking about they've been having problems with them. I've seen comments on YouTube about it. So I'm going to show you guys how to install the new version of Chill Callouts, guys. Uh, these were just updated yesterday, okay? I'm going to be installing them with you because I have not installed them myself yet. I just found out they were updated. So go ahead and click that link down there, guys. It says Chill Callouts. It's going to bring you this page right here. This is the brand new version, guys. Brand spanking new. Uh, 1.0.5.5. Uh, whatever you say that right there. 5. And then... Uh, we're going to scroll down, guys. If you look right here, if you guys ever want to know how, when these things are updated, it will tell you right here in this uh, file information section. See, it says updated um, yesterday at 10.05 a.m., and they were submitted on January 28th. So that will tell you right there, guys, if you ever want to know. You know, I don't recommend using any uh, kind of uh, outdated stuff, you know. I just never do because it makes your game crash. Uh, and if you want to check out your files, what you're getting yourself into, like what kind of files you're getting, you can always come right here where it says inside the file and click this right here and then double click that double click that and there is all your callouts guys see that that's everything right there that'll blow up your INI file there's your settings INI and then of course in the settings INI you won't see any of that till you get into the file itself inside of your LSPFR folder so go ahead and click this download this file button right here guys click that and we're going to click agree and download all right, and then we are going to wait on that little window to pop up. There it is. What do you want to do with chill callouts, guys? You can click save here to put in your downloads folder, or click this little arrow and, and do as I recommend and click save as, and then go right here underneath where it says this PC, click desktop, desk, <laughs> desktop, click save, and then it'll put it on your download on your uh, desktop for you. I can't talk today, guys. All right, so let's go ahead and close out of that. Guys, uh, let's go ahead and pull up our GTA 5 main directory uh, right here. Uh, this is what you're going to need. If you do not know how to locate your main directory, I will leave a link in the description below showing you how to do that, okay? If you're, in a mod if you're into modding, you should know how to locate your main directory by now. Uh, if not, I will leave a link down there showing you guys how to do that, okay? So go ahead and double click on your WinRAR, your Chill Callouts WinRAR. And all you're going to do, guys, uh, you can always open up the readme's here and it'll tell you how to install. Well, this doesn't give you any instructions, but most of them do. Uh, all you got to do, guys, is grab this plugins folder right here. Grab, grab it, drag it, and drop it in your main directory just like that. Now, it's going to ask me to replace it. So I'm going to go ahead and replace it because I have the old version of it. If it asks you to replace something, just do it. Just, just go ahead and replace it. If it doesn't, don't worry about it. It's going to be fine. Now, go to your plugins folder. In your main directory like this, click LSPDFR, and here's your chill callouts folder right here. Okay, there's your, uh, and this is your settings. So uh, right here, and I'm not sure if we really need to mess in this. Yeah, let's leave that alone, guys. Let's actually go back and go down to the INI file of chill callouts, which is going to be. Da -da 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 -da. There's no. Okay, so that was the INI file, the settings up there, I guess. Because I don't see one in here. So that's it, guys. That's all there is for that installation. Uh, go back to your main directory and click um, click your refresh button. And then close out of your WinRAR and get rid of that shortcut. Now, guys, I do highly recommend uh, having Callout Manager if you want to be able to pull up your callouts on your own and and pick the callouts that you want. If, if you don't, that's fine. But if you do want Callout Manager and you don't know what that is... It's a it's a plugin for your game, and it allows you to pull up your your callouts within the game itself, and you can choose what callout you want. Okay, you just click on it, select the callout, dispatch calls the callout for you. Okay, for those of you that want to know how what that is and what it does, I will leave a link in the description below, uh, leading you to my tutorial that shows you how to install Callout Manager. Uh, it is outdated, guys, but it still works like a dream. I still use it all the time. Uh, but that's pretty much it, guys. Go on the game. Check out your chill callouts. Thank you guys for joining. I appreciate the love and support so much, guys. I love you so, so much. Until next time, God bless. Take care. Stay in prayer.
love one another. And peace out.